It's the one only Despotic bring you guys another gameplay commentary. This is Black Ops 2. This is a gameplay on Standoff. I, I honestly think Standoff is a pretty uh, good map. Uh, just stay out from, stay away from all the long lines of sight, and you, you won't have too many, too many issues with the snipers and so on and so forth. But I, uh, I'm using MSMC. Surprisingly, right? I still use this gun, man. I, I, I still use it. I'm just a bit more cautious, and uh, you know, I pick my shots. Like I can't make shots like that I used to make. And it's a little bit more difficult, and it takes a bit more skill. And so you don't really see a lot of people running around with submachine guns anymore, um, which is uh, it's okay because then you do get to dominate uh, if you are running a submachine gun and you get into the kind of you know range that you want to get into. Unless it's a shotgun, dude, and then your ass is done. But this commentary is just about like playing your role. Right? Everyone wants to be a slayer. Everyone wants to say like they're a rusher, right? No one really says like, "Hey, dude, I'm 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 a straight up camper." They wouldn't say that. But let's 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 kind of not saying you're a camper, but let's say you're a defensive player, right? Like defensive players in 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 some ways have gotten like this negative kind of like this you know negative connotation. On, on like, hey, this person is defensive and they're head glitching and they're clipping. And, you know, I, I don't think any of those things are wrong. Right? I think the extremes are kind of like, kind of problematic. Because if you camp, that's, that's fucking retarded. And if you rush to the point where you, you're non-stop, I, I, think that's, I think that's retarded as well, right? Don't get, like, people are like, oh my god, I can't believe you said that. Like, El Presador... He rushes all the time, and look what happens to him, right? He doesn't think. And he's a funny guy, but he just doesn't think. And I've somewhat been reevaluating how, how I play this game and, like, what is it that I really want to, like, incorporate into my to, to my play style, right? Like, there's this, you know, I used to upload. I think he still has a channel. I call him the Manchester Beast, Undaunted Disc. And he's a solid fucking... Like he will, you know, you would consider this dude a slayer because, you know, he's he's passive aggressive and he's, you know, he needs when he needs to be aggressive he can be that way. When he needs to be passive he can be that way. And I think that's what a person who will use any kind of non cheesy way of killing your ass, right? If he has to lay prone and hide behind a, a corner or a grass for a few seconds just to wait for you to kill you after he's killed you multiple times he, he will do that if he has to like jump into a room and just fuck everything up and kill like four or five people he'll do that and I think you have to have that kind of equal medium and the reason why I say I, I don't think like camping and 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 rushing they're basically to me the they're at the opposite end of the spectrum and for some reason people believe that because you rush, you're you're a better player than someone who camps. But I, I don't think so. I think really good players are the ones. I know I'm going on and on, and I'm going off topic. I'm saying all of these phrases: rushers, slayers, campers, defensive players. But I, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen so many videos. You know, just the vocabulary and the the language that people tend to use. You know, we all know noob, right? Noob is universal, so. I don't want to hear any comments in the section. I don't want to hear, see any comments or like read comments. Like, well, I didn't know what you were talking about. I, I, I don't get that, but I'm just, I'm just being. Uh, anyway, forget it. Forget about that. And I don't think rushing or camping. I don't think those those two things are, are different. Like one is just being extremely, you know, cautious. Another one is being, you know doesn't care and they basically accomplish the same thing one is pissed off the <laughs> other one is scared because if you rush and then there's some games that allow you to rush and if you look at some players and you say like the well, mark of J rushes no he doesn't like I, I doubt he'll call himself a rusher right he, I honestly think he's a passive aggressive player he picks he, you know he chooses like when to be aggressive and when to be passive and I think that's what a lot of people have gotten away from you look at all of these YouTube videos and they think like well I really want to be this way but they might not have that kind of skill look at this shit 
always getting trolled. Like I'm like less than ten points away from another VSAT, or was it a, a load star? Would have been three load stars, but I mean I'm pretty sure that's not a record. But uh, and I usually get these anyway. So I, I honestly think you need to be passive aggressive, and sometimes aggressive passive if you want to be more so, so more so on that kind of side. But rushing is is not it doesn't make you a good player. It doesn't make you better than someone who camps. I mean, it might make you feel better that you're running around a lobby and going like 1 in 5 or like 1 in 10, 0 oh in 12. And this shit happens all the time. I see lots and lots of people. And I'm always thinking, you know, is this dude boosting? Are these guys boosting? And then you, you know, you go and you see what's going on. And they're, in fact, trying to rush around every fucking corner. They don't work smart. They work hard. And... And that's, that's what I think is somewhat problematic. I think this game really frowns on rushing. And uh, it really hurts you. I mean, in Modern Warfare 3, you could rush. But it's the same thing. You have to be very passive-aggressive. And, uh, you know, that's, that's, that's the way you need to be. Like, I've, look, I've been looking at, who is it? I think Optic, Optic Scumpy? Or whatever his name is. And, you know, even though... <laughs> Uh, and, and that play, that guy's probably, they say he's probably like the best slayer uh, on COD. And he's he's passive aggressive. Like, I've seen this dude play, and he's very passive aggressive. And I think that's the way people need to play. Now, you might look at me and say, what the fuck is this guy talking about? I could kill. That's what he's saying. I like to rush. I want to rush. And then there's some people saying, hey, I can't move around the map, I don't know, I don't have map awareness, I don't know where they're spawning, I keep getting shot in the back, so I feel like just sitting in one spot and not moving. Look, I completely understand that this won't work for everyone, but if you give it a try, and then hopefully it might work for you, and it might not. If it isn't working for you, just look at some of, some of my tips and tricks videos. People say that, you know, these tips, you know, my, my tips and tricks videos uh, have helped, you know, it's helped them, uh, and uh, so then look at them. You know, I haven't put them in any kind of kind of group or anything. I'm just lazy. I don't. I don't. Just go in, go in and search the videos. I think I have like 600, well, 700 plus videos. Look at that. Cut him off. Boom. Done. Anyway, it's the one only. Spotic deuces.